how are these children i am going to discuss subtraction of integer and uh, how to represent by number line now i am writing a question 2 subtracting minus 3 now when after evaluating we are getting the value minus 1 now how to represent on the number line plus 2 means positive direction it will move two steps so plus 2 from 0 to plus 2 then minus 3 again one steps two steps then three steps so you have to put arrow you have to remember that which direction you have to put arrow so one two steps moving two steps again negative direction means the left side you have to move three steps one two three so you answer you are getting minus 1 now next question minus 2 minus 3 in that case after evaluating you are getting the result minus 5 then how to represent on the number line 0 so minus 2 at first so minus 2 means negative direction minus 1 minus 2 from 0 on or minus 2 steps after reaching minus 2 steps then again minus 3 then again from 2 1 steps 2 steps 3 steps so you have to give direction this side so here minus 3 minus 4 minus 5 now here i have taken one positive both are positive number subtracting and here one negative number one positive number of subtraction of one positive number one negative number now next question you can write like that minus 2 minus then 3 minus 3 in that case what will be the answer minus 2 minus minus plus 3 so answer will come plus 1 now how to represent on the number line minus 2 and plus 3 so you have to write minus 2 1 2 minus 1 minus 2 steps from 0 to that direction moving then plus 3 steps again that way 1 2 3 steps so finally going this way so answer is 1 so children here you see that answer is plus 1 and this direction what result comes 1 after moving so how to do from always you have to start from 0 either in the positive side or negative side as given in the question so minus 1 it is given minus 2 it is given so minus 2 means two steps left side you have to move two steps left side and plus 3 again three steps forward you have to go right side so one steps two steps three steps so your result comes one so when we are representing in the number line which direction you have to put arrow that is very important then this is the subtraction of integer how to represent by number line now i shall discuss addition and subtraction of uh, more than 3 integer how to solve now i am writing few sums how to evaluate the value now how to evaluate taking some uh, integers positive integer and negative integer now first question is given minus how to solve first one first question minus 346 minus within the bracket min negative integer so minus minus plus 1275 now plus value is greater so plus value when plus value to sign will be plus and we have to subtract then after subtracting we shall get answer will come 929 now next question 
121 minus 121 minus minus plus when removing the bracket. 78 plus minus minus removing the bracket plus sign 576. Now children always you remember that when outside the bracket negative sign is there then the sign will when we remove the bracket sign will change. If positive then it will become negative. If negative then it will become positive. Now here you see negative sign. Outside the bracket negative minus sign so sign will be plus. So sign will be plus. But here positive sign outside the bracket inside minus sign so in that case sign will remain same sign will not change now all the negative value i shall separate minus 121 minus 193 plus 78 plus 576 now negative value i have to add negative value We are getting 314, 4, 11 and 3 plus 78, then 4, 15 and 6, 654 and 314. Now after subtracting we shall get 340. So how to solve? Uh, I think it is very clear. You have to remove bracket at first. Then how to remove the bracket? You can uh, use that method. You have to know that uh, part that plus plus plus. Plus minus minus. Minus minus plus. So here you see minus minus plus. And plus minus minus. That rule also you can remember or you have you can remember that outside the bracket if negative sign then when removing the bracket sign will change outside the bracket positive sign sign will remain same that is also you can remember and you can apply to solve now next line what i have done negative value i have separated positive value i have separated so all the negative value i have this to negative value i have added and sign will be minus and the positive value I have added and sign will be plus. Now positive value is greater so sign will be plus and you have to subtract when one plus sign another minus sign you have to subtract from one another. Next question subtract. In case of subtraction what is the question? Minus 6 subtract minus 6 from 9. So question you try to always children you are making mistake you are writing minus 6 at, at first then minus 9. No absolutely wrong. So what you have to do minus 6 from 9. So from 9 means 9 you have to from 9 you are going to subtract minus 6. Subtract means minus and minus 6 within the bracket. Now how to solve 9 minus minus plus 6. So your answer will come 15 because both digits are positive so you have to add. Now second sum how to solve? Again minus 376 from 10 so you have to write at first 10. 10 minus you have to subtract minus 376 equals to 10 minus minus plus 376. Both are plus. So you have to add. Then your answer will come 386. So children when you are evaluating you know that when any number minus number and within the bracket and minus sign outside the bracket sign will change. If any number or negative number in the bracket and plus sign is there, sign will not change. The number will remain as it is. So, where the sign will change, that I have explained on how to evaluate.
and that also I have explained in this chapter. So children, you go through the chapter, enjoy all the sums and solve, try to solve by your own. Thank you children.